Yo yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new F1 2022 video. Today, we're gonna be do doing something that's just probably not a very smart idea. We're gonna be doing a 100% for Seedback Challenge. Um, so what we're gonna be doing is putting 100% for Seedback in my Simic Q profile, which is 32 Newton meters of torque. As you can see here, it actually 31.4 newton meters of torque now just for um a good comparison my car has 300 newton meters we're gonna be using 31.4 so pretty crazy to think that we're gonna be using over one tenth of torque bit of a useless comparison but i uh <laughs> just want to flex you know uh, let's uh, continue with uh, the last of first challenge, 25% race around the brand new um, circuit of the Americas. And as you can hear, brand new background so uh, song as well. It's beautiful. I think so. I think it's an absolute banger. Anyway, let's go to the race. Now in the game, I'm going to be using 100, not 150, as I think... 150 will be a little bit too crazy. Also, the challenge is 100% force feedback, not 150. We are going to be starting on the mediums. Let's lower the fuel a little bit. And we are using the increased top speed setup. Formation lap first, so we can actually feel what this force feedback is like. Um, I'm already a little bit scared, not going to lie. I decided to go for 25% raises, 50% would be completely killing. Um, I think I'm scared to have a snap of oversteer. As soon as I get a snap of oversteer, I will not touch my wheel anymore. Oh my god. It's okay so far, but the scary thing is that the force deck and high speed gets higher. So yeah. Warm my tires a little bit. Oh, I can barely turn the wheel at this point. This 25% race is gonna be nuts. Anyway, let's head into the race. All right, little update on the formation lap. The force feedback has gotten much higher because the tires are warmed up, which is very realistic, but it's not very ideal for us. Also, I saw a lot of people ask what happens if you drive into the pit lane on your formation lap. But unfortunately, you just get reset um, to the final corner. So, yeah, weaving is not ideal as well. Warm up our rears a little bit. Beautiful lineup on the grid. Let's head into the race. One of the most dangerous races I've done, probably, even though I've raced in real life for 13 years. Um, 31 newton meter of torque is gonna be used in this oh my god please stay away from me please i do not want to hit anyone in turn one oh my god that sausage curve almost killed me now i cannot afford to touch anyone or i'll probably break my hands oh Not to mention that in those 13 years of racing, I never drove with power steering. But even then, this is so much harder. Uh, and I've gotten much stronger in the meantime as well. Oh. Alright. So now that I'm on the please don't hit me. I will die. Oh, what a scent! Beautiful. Snowda. Pulling off a primary Ricciardo. On Vettel. Oh my god, don't hit me, Magnussen. Are we gonna send it? Are we gonna send it? No. I barely turned the wheel. I think front tires have just hit there. No. Yeah, they've just run up. And I can feel that. Of course, they dip a little bit at the start, and then they heat up throughout the lap again. Anyways, we're on the mediums. A 
Now, if you know how dark drives work, 100% force feedback is a lot. Uh, and it's very hard to turn. But the scary thing is if it snaps on you, oh, that's a valid tree. If it snaps on you, it's gonna go mad and you just have to let it go basically. And if you don't, you're gonna be in trouble. I'm struggling hard in these sections. I'm not gonna have to go to the gym tomorrow. Now we're on the mediums as well. Imagine if I go onto the softs. Because basically, very simply said, the more grip you get, the harder the force feedback gets. Because you get more grip, which means more resistance on the wheel. Um, works in real life that way as well. And now we're gonna go around the outside of Sebastian Vettel. Oh my god, what a scent. Oh, that over serves. Scary. Please don't hit me in this battle. If I get any. Big snap of overstair. It will be the scariest moment of my life. Ah! I can barely do this flat out now. Oh. I think the Ferrari has gone off. That is. Saints. Oh, my hands are already cramping up. But we have to keep pushing. It's only 11 laps remaining. Oh, the girl! Saints in front of us. We're using, we are going to be using quite a bit of battery here. Try and get clear of Ricciardo. Into the next one. So now that Saints battling hearts. That goes a lot better when someone doesn't turn in. Saints up next. So that was a massive scent. I had to stop on the apex though. See if you can keep up with Saints. Now at the moment I'm not even on the limit of my driving abilities, I'm on the limit of my strength. Literally, the harder I try, the faster I go, so... Nice to drive in some way like that. Alright, we're gonna get the rest again, which is good. I reckon the softs are going to be dropping off slowly in the next few laps. We can start making some moves. Alright, big sand coming up. Big lunch. On the inside. Oh, Joe. Another position gain. Softs are dropping off. Lewis is in the pits now. Lewis has boxed. Many more are boxing. Let's see if we can get the rest. Yeah, we will. That's great. That is on two hearts. I don't know how that is going to work. But Oh, it's so tough. My muscles are burning. Now they're struggling on those softs. The rest gain is so big. Now 
on the outside. Oh, Norris looked up. I have no idea what he did. Maybe on my spawn or something. Anyway, that's a bit of time lost for us. Oh, I actually managed to catch the overstep. Alright, I think we're officially not going to make the last of the challenge just for stopping and being a second and us in that last lap. Which is fine. You just need to try and finish this race without breaking my wrist into pieces. Alright, stopping 36.3 with a 38.6. So I think that shows that our tires are finished. Just like my arms at the end of this race. Probably time to box now and go on to a new set of softs and put five qualifying laps in. Stop and ride with us. Anyway, we're not gonna hold them up. We're gonna box. Or confirmed, we'll receive you at the end of this lap. New set of softs! Oh, trying to move through the MFD menu with one hand. It's not ideal. Anyway, let's box. I've decided to go for the broadcast mode. I have no idea what... Oh, that's gonna look like this. Uh, I'm not glad I'm not a huge fan of the turning into the... And away into we the go. box. No problems, very smooth. Mercedes will no doubt be very happy with that stop. <laughs> that's pretty cool, actually. Anyway. I hope it ends before. Okay, it ended a little bit after. We've not lost any time to change actually. So, it's been an overcut. That lasted three laps. Went pretty well then. We need to warm up those softs. Which should happen a lot faster than the mediums. And let things go. We're gonna get DRS. And then we get him back. That's the plan. Alright, easy overtake. This tire should be warmed up in the final sector and then we're gonna hunt down Ocon for P6 oh yellow flag for someone oh it's really good never mind we're getting quite a bit to Ocon at the moment but our time is running out oh Magnussen is out we been two seconds too long in the last lap Oh, big oversteer! That cost a lot of time. Alright, fast lap of the race, 35 9. Let's see what Oak on that. Oak on ahead, and gap to the car in front is 4.7 seconds. They're on old mediums. Their tyres are 5 laps old, and the time last lap was a 1.37.8. 36 2 from us, 2 laps to go. Oak on is ahead of you. Okay, gap ahead is. Three point one seconds. They're on old mediums. Their tires are six laps old. Time last lap was a one minute thirty-seven point nine. You're gaining by one point six seconds a lap. One point six second gain. We very much need that in the coming two laps as well. Are we not gaining enough? Ocon ahead. Our gap to the car in front is one point four seconds. They're on old mediums. Okay, their tyres are seven laps old. Your last lap time was a 137.8. You're gaining by 1.6 seconds a lap. It's not enough, Jeff! Or Ruben. We're gonna call you Ruben from now on. You're not Jeff anymore. We're gonna call you Ruben for no reason. Alright, we are gonna get DRS probably. Just about. Oh. Ocon has a much more ERS than us. If we want to get him, we need to get him somewhere in the last sector, but we run out of ERS. He's dumping it. Even with the ERS, we're not gaining. 
we've lost on this thread. Can you do something? A bit of a lock up for me. No, we're too far away to send it. No! Ruben, you've lied to us. Mama! I don't know how that did not snap my wrist to oblivion. Anyway, can we do a 360 here? A lightweight baby. And my wheel. My wheel is so hot, you cannot imagine. I reckon it's well over 100 degrees. I, I could literally cook something on it now. Anyway, that was 100%. Shut up. Red Bull. But there's no question in my mind, it has to... Thank you. That was the 100% for Feedback Challenge. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and also subscribe for more F1 2022. And see you guys next time. Ciao.